ready to enjoy this guided meditation on the holiday symbol of candlelight today. After this candlelight meditation, each time you see the holiday symbol, you can remember the or tap into that namaste meaning and the simple Christmas guided meditation to manage holiday stress and instead connect with that divine light that's within you. This video is part of a whole series of holiday meditations. You can use them as your daily meditation practice. This one is being released for your Christmas Eve meditation. And um, it's also would make a really good winter solstice meditation. And whenever you need to manage some holiday stress, I'm just gonna take that moment to reset and realign. If you wanna click the subscribe button below, you can be notified each time a new guided meditation is released. And I'm Krista Strayer with Fifth Flourish Yoga, and I'm your wellness and lifestyle coach using Ayurveda and essential oils, sharing some simple Ayurvedic tips for healthy daily habits. And this is actually the perfect time of year to add Ayurvedic essential oils into your daily meditation practice or to start a practice. This Christmas guided meditation will help along with, I have a super duper um, easy um, essential oils for meditation. Some of my favorite essential oils for different types of meditation, depending on what you want to get out of your experience, whether it's grounding, uh, relaxing, inspiring, creating, uh, and then love and connection. I've kind of listed, listed all of my favorites on this sheet. So if you want to click the link to um, download that, it's in the comments and it's also in the description. That makes it super easy to just add one of these um, essential oils into your practice and it just takes you to that immediate uh, sense of, of presence and it kind of slips you deeper into your meditation experience. All right, if you stay to the end, we're actually gonna wrap up this Divine Light Meditation with a simple practice that you can do anytime, anywhere, so that each time you see a candle, you can go right into that moment. So it's gonna make it even, even easier than following along. Uh, but you can always come back to this one over and over as, as well. All right, so before we get started, I want you to choose your Ayurvedic essential oil um, for the candlelight meditation that connects you to the light that shines within you. Okay, so there's a few oils that are really good at this. And so I've you know, chosen a few of my favorites for this one. They might also become your favorites for meditation on your round, not just during the holiday season. So the first one is a holiday blend, but it's like my new favorite all-time blend. It's called Holiday Love, and it's from doTERRA, so it's the doTERRA Holiday Love. And it has, um, it's a collection of different scents. It almost brings to mind when I first lit the candle, there's that, that smell of the wax, um, or the, the wick kind of burning, it kind of brings that into it. It's really warming and nurturing. So it's, uh, it's a lovely one for that. So it kind of inspires um, community within that, some warmth, some inspiration, some connection, all kinds of goodies. Another great oil to choose from is the frankincense essential oil from doTERRA. So this oil is known to dispel darkness, right? So perfect when we're looking at the light. Uh, it helps to kind of um, illuminate the truth, right? And instills a, a sense of trust and safety around us. So that's a really good one for this um, particular meditation. Another beautiful one is Melissa essential oil. This is actually known as the oil of light. And so it helps to kind of um, polish your lens so that your light shines brighter. So that's a great one for that. And then I also selected the Arise blend from doTERRA, so the Arise doTERRA blend. And this is a part of the Yoga Blend series. And it's another, it's a blend again, and it contains Melissa along with a couple citrus oils and some little floral oils. And it's really nice just to um, kind of give you some clarity so that that sense of light from the Melissa, and then it kind of instills this sense of empowerment and courage. So it's definitely a favorite of mine for meditation. It's a really good one to use, to tap into. So after you've chosen your oil and what's gonna work for you, I want you just to take that oil and place a drop in your hand, in your palm. One to two drops is great. And then before we kind of rub our hands together, just take a, a little bit of that and you're going to place it on your heart or your sternum, kind of right over your heart chakra within that. And then you can go ahead and rub your hands together and just breathe that in, kind of get connected to that. For this guided meditation, it's okay to sit, to stand, or to lie down, right? You can even do this as a walking meditation if you're listening along as you're out on your, on your morning walk. So wherever you feel comfortable, yet still alert, right? So our Candles. Let's dive into that symbology before we um, close our eyes. The candle 
those are that symbol of light and luminosity. So as you interact with people this holiday season, try to see that luminosity and that light that emanates from each person that you connect with, that light that comes from within. And remember that you too are that light, right? So that whenever you see a candle, you can you know, see that flickering light. There's something there that draws us in. It's kind of mesmerizing, right? And so remember you have that same feeling inside of you. You have that essence that draws others in and creates that sense of awe, that sense of warmth within you. So I want you to think of what are the practices that you can do to help your light shine this holiday season. Perhaps it's this daily meditation practice, right? Perhaps it's just simply, you know, having some oils going around in your house. Perhaps it's the foods you eat or the habits that you do every day. What can you do to look after yourself? And that will help your light to shine even brighter. And that's kind of part one. And then the other part is how do you treat others? So that patience that you have, the love that you should that you kind of let shine through, um, it just kind of helps to kind of polish off that lens of your light. Okay, so sitting up nice and tall or wherever you're gonna take this, just kind of reconnect to that oil by taking three deep breaths in. And then kind of popping into that space of awareness and calm relaxation. Just gently close your eyes or you can focus on the candlelight um, on the screen or on a candle that's in the space around you. Just roll your shoulders back and down, taking a nice deep breath in and a deep breath out. And just start to connect. Scan through your body. Where do you feel the dark spots today? What areas do you feel that are not shining? What areas of your body feel light and clear? Just notice. And take a deep breath out. And as you breathe in, fill your body with warmth and light. Feel the sense of light that emanates from your heart outwards. to your breath and recognizing that sense of the divine that is within you. And ask yourself, what can you do to allow yourself to shine just a little brighter? And what can you do to help see the light that is within others? Recognize the beauty that is within the flame, the warmth. And there is that sense of magic that's within the flame that draws us in. Just gently breathing in. And as you breathe out, just feel that warmth inside of you that emanates from your heart outwards to all parts of your body. remember that whenever you see a candle, it's another version of Namaste. The light that is within you is reflected back in others. As you focus on the candle, you can remember your own divinity, your own light. Taking a deep breath in, deep breath out, just let it go with a sigh. Feeling your shoulders release down. And you can gently open your eyes again. And I'm super curious, do you feel that same mesmerizing connection when you see a flame that I do? You can post that below. And also, does that flame, when you see that, now have a deeper meaning for you as you connect into that and feel that sense of of warmth and love that lives within you. So at Flourish Yoga, we are all about making things simple and easy. Simple, easy, effective is our motto. Um, so if you're new to meditation, I have a great little meditation video to try. Just 
it's one or two minutes where you can tap into that quick you know, check in within. So you can click that on the screen. And if you're new to essential oils, um, check out the Ayurvedic Essential Oils playlist for all kinds of tips on getting started and how the oils work. And don't forget to click the link to download that favorite essential oils fermentation guide. Um, the link is in the comments. And the guide is an easy reference um, to use those Ayurvedic essential oils to complement your meditation experience. Uh, plus, there's also the sorts of tips in there on um, your daily meditation practice. So we have those coming with that guide as well. So if you enjoyed this and found it helpful, click the like button because that tells me what other content to make. So if you like this one, um, and if you found it, um, you connected to it, that you enjoyed it, if you click that button, that knows that I, that tells me to make some more just like this one. And there's also, you can check out those playlists for essential oil meditations, yoga and essential oil classes, Ayurvedic tips and healthy daily habits, everything you need to amplify your wellness lifestyle. And this season, for your simple little practice, each time you see the candle, remember that light within you. And then we'll say namaste, and we'll honor that divine light within you. All right, namaste. Thank you for joining me in this practice today.